the KHQA Student Athlete of the Week, sponsored by Blessing Health System. I'm always just confident. I was excited. You know, it's first district game. It's win or go home. So I was ready. I was excited. Um, and I mean, yeah, I was, just, I was locked in. I was focused. His long distance district marksmanship Monday, highlighted by a first quarter that saw him convert all five of his three point attempts, is just the latest evidence that Wyatt Harrison elevates every enterprise he's involved in. It's a lot of fun. I mean, if I, if I score a lot, score a little, it's, it's always fun for me, so. Most evidently football, where his first team all conference skills on both sides of the ball have given him a college future with Fontbonne's sprint program but also along the way help stabilize and reverse years of Louisiana lethargy. Yeah, I take, I take a lot of pride in it. I mean, I put a lot of effort in it, so that, a lot of pride comes with it. Um, so I'm, hope, I'm hoping they do get better over the years, and they will. Um, it's, it's going up right now, so it hopefully keeps going. His example is an ideal teammate as critical within that turn as his talent itself. Yeah, that's, that's a big compliment for me. I'm, I'm a leader. I encourage people. I, I encourage everybody to be good and work hard. It is a pride in performance and leadership with Wyatt that doesn't end at the hash marks. He's not only an honor roll student himself. Yeah, it's, it's pretty much the same effort, you know, the same type of effort. Uh, get the stuff done first, get it out the way, and then I can play sports and work hard on that. Um, and that's, that's also comes from the coaches, like Coach Pitzer, Smith. You know, why, why waste all your effort on the sports and not on the school? You know, might as well, everything in life, you know, go hard at. But Devote's time as a first grade tutor, they help set a standard at the start of future Bulldogs educations as well. Well, I mean, it always helps, you know, it's, it's a good, you're, you're a role model, you're a leader in the community when you play as many sports and I mean, when you're good at it, you work hard. So, um, just helping little kids, you know, giving them, setting them, giving them the right example as they grow up, you know, so they know what to do and how to do it. Moreover, this is a young man who uniquely understands the value of everything and every experience in life. Yes, as a future business major. Yeah, math kind of just stuck with me. I like, I, I don't know what it is, it's math, I'm really good at it, and it just comes easy to me. And I just like, you know, going through a problem and solving it and getting the answer, the right answer at the end, you know, doing everything right, so. And I'm, I'm really tight with my money, I'm good with my money, so that's, if anybody, any of my friends will tell you, I'm always tight with it, and I, I spend my money wisely and I'm good with math so I think that'd be a, a course or an area that I could excel in. But also as the first in his family to blaze a trail to college. It's a real really like I always dreamed of it kind of but I never really when I uh, when I got to high school I could see the big picture and I really it really I really understood like how hard it really is to make it and you know that just that pushed me and uh, wanting to get money to help pay for my college because I'm not I don't have a lot of money in my family so anything that helps um, I worked hard at, and that's what I set my mind to, so it's, it's surreal. And within that, the value as well of the support he's received along his journey. Yeah, it's shaped me a lot, um, especially the sports, I'd say the most, because, I mean, I grew up kind of with my mom a lot. You know, my dad was in and out, but um, he was there. He was there. He helped a lot, but sports, I'd say, helped the most. Um, it, it showed me how to work hard and always work hard in everything you do in life. And in, in the community, I made great friends, you know, and it's been great since I moved here, you know, I've loved it ever since.